How's it going everybody? My cup of tea here, back from the reaction video, and we're here with some more the generosity videos. Yay, yay. Now this video kind of came up out of nowhere on my feed because I was just scrolling through and all of a sudden I saw the thumbnail of this video caught my attention because I'm like, is that Beyblade? So that's what we're gonna be doing today. We're gonna be watching childhood toys. Now I had quite a bit of toys back then when I was a kid. I never had Beyblade toys back then as a kid, but I went to a friend's house who did have like a Beyblade toys and like a whole stadium thing. And I tried to let it rip. I couldn't figure out how to. I didn't get the instructions. I just, I couldn't do it. <laughs> but enough about that. Let's just watch this video because I'm curious what toys we're gonna be looking at here. And he's always fun to watch the generosity. In the BCE era, there okay. was nothing. True, kind of. I mean, there were a few things, yeah. but it was <laughs> mad boring. Humans boring. were still in the Neanderthal stages back then. So all the kids would do was play with sticks and rocks or even worse, read for the entertainment. And yeah, read, sometimes yeah. like playing with sticks too when I was young, but that could get pretty old. There was yep. no variety of toys. Yeah, they had dolls and plagues going on, but not much else. That's plagues. why during Jesus' time when he was turning water into wine was the best source of anything remotely interesting back then, other than maybe gladiator fights. And even though nowadays, oh, that ain't nice. even all that hype anymore. I've seen videos of people turning toilet water into wine. Ew. So I need something more interesting. You better turn that water into some bitches, my boy. Then you catch my <laughs> attention. And yet time has moved on and toys have gotten more advanced. Fidget I forgot spinners. I was talking about toys, especially for the adults. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, them out, just go in the back of your local Spencers. <laughs> Spencers. But I don't pay for those pocket stuff. Men, I personally recommend the storm drain of the sink. It works just as well. And I'm glad I got <laughs> I to live do after don't the time that. of playing with bones for toys and before just giving a kid an iPhone and calling it a child. Oh, yeah, before it was that, good yeah, times, yeah. man. They were playing good with those stretchy too. Armstrong yeah. guys, testing out how far one. I could go until his arms rip off. Oh, playing the, with those Jesus. squishy putty slime things, making a yeah, I had that. Yeah, yeah, okay, well, that I, I didn't do that. I didn't do that. Back then, man. I didn't do that. Did y'all do that too? I remember no. a toy I used to play with a lot was those etch a sketch, those turn dial drawn. I kind of had. That. I loved and hated using these things because I, I found it fascinating. Figures, I could make yeah. a whole beautiful work of art figures. on these little boards. Um, the thing was, I, I sucked ass at it. Every <laughs> time I tried making a sketch on this toy, it always looked like a five-year-old drew it. Which I was around that age when I drew it, but uh, okay, okay. He looked fight. like a five-year-old <laughs> drew it who also didn't have fingers. You know, Dang. seeing other people on the internet make a whole Renaissance painting How? using these while I'm over here struggling to make a stick it, figure, it, it, it hurts your self-esteem. Seriously, it does. people it that can make Let a great out, art Let with these things are seriously more talented than. Obama, hey I think. So to cope, I just made 3D art with these pinboard things with my hands. I also enjoyed playing with action figures. A yeah, lot. action figures. Having Bionicles and Spider-Man yeah, Spider smashing yep, them yep. against each other. Is By the way, <laughs> Thomas the Tank Engine was yeah, always too. Yeah, yeah. all of my action figures in a fight. I don't make the rules. <laughs> Thomas can beat Spider-Man, Batman, That's Sonic, terrifying. Stone Cold Steve Austin. Not Stone Cold Steve Austin. I don't make the rules, man. But a toy I thankfully never played with were those Tickle Me Elmos. I remember when those I were know. the must-have toys have at Elmo? one point. Everybody would have one. Buying it for their kids, nephews, or even their <laughs> grandparents. Disney. It was the perfect He's gift. Done. But I never got one because I didn't trust it. Hearing the stories of the disgusting things Elmo would say. The things Elmo would supposedly do. I said stop tickling me. It didn't sit right with me. <laughs> okay. There was something sinister behind his toy. I can behind feel that it. Lab, However, behind with that me not liking that, I did like watches. I love getting hey. those digital watches like Casio or watch. any kind That's of really character watch. watch like SpongeBob <laughs> or Mario. And when I got these watches, I'd flex that shit like it was a paddock. I felt like the <laughs> man. But my biggest watch flex was my Ben 10 Omnitrix hey, watch. Hey, Ben 10 watch? That's Best watch up. I've ever That's owned. I remember hey. getting that watch at Walgreens and the next day showing it off to my fourth grade class at school. Most of them, they're <laughs> like real fuck, but I was feeling myself that day. I was right Ben too. 10 at You're that right moment. Too. Nobody stopping me from turning into an alien and wreaking havoc across town. <laughs> also, I've noticed. Back then, the best toys I played with were the ones outside of my house. Like in early elementary, they'd have a selection of a little bit of everything. And also, mm. these things would be in every yes. single Ooh. dock. Nope, nope, nope. nope. It'd have a Going selection back. of a little bit of everything. And also, these... I love those things. Never go to a doctor's like office as a kid. I love them. Over here, it's been like 20 minutes. Like, ooh, ooh, mom, mom, like, we gotta go. Like, hold on, give me, give me a second, give me a second. Even nowadays, I'm like, I'm trying to resist the urge. Whenever I go to like a doctor's place, I'm like... Let me resist the urge to play with this. I really want to, but nah, nah. Like, I leave that side of me alone. That was like when I was a kid, slash teenager. Let's not touch that. But who? I love this thing right here. I love this so much. <laughs> I, woo, woo. 
<laughs> oh, sorry. I just love Things that. will be in every single doctor's I office I've it. ever been in. And I don't even know what these things called, but they were the either. shit. And they at were, school, you we know, was trading you know, silly up. bands and Pokemon cards. Does anyone bands. even know how to play the Pokemon card game? No I don't does. even know. <laughs> Soul <laughs> Cup stacking does. was a big thing during the after school and before school programs. Bakugan, bro. Bakugan is an underrated phase, bro. We needed more people on that back then. If you weren't a Bakugan kid, Dude, I don't know you weren't right living. Now. Bakugans <laughs> were so cool, bro. But the best anime toys were the Beyblades, yeah, man! Knows. This was Beyblade. probably my favorite toy phase of my boyhood. And if you were born in, I don't know, 2012, <laughs> yeah, the Beyblades were these spinning top metal toys that what we would make go against one another, and the last one standing gets the booty. It also had a hype as hell anime that was on Cartoon Network. And She's every that. boy was playing this during opening. elementary school recess. I'm Sometimes one of us would bring our own stadiums, and then we would brawl out and let it rip, bro! And dudes were pulling out so many cool-looking Beyblades, man. He dudes were pulling out I gold and silver Beyblades. There. One dude even had a Pegasus, the one a in the Pegasus? anime. Pegasus? We're gonna drink then, That was we'll a drink big and showing off any kind of luxury like <laughs> that's cool and all but i like this one better i envy those guys because i didn't have no beyblades i was broke Dang. my mom barely got me toys she got Dang. me consoles instead first world problems i Who know wants but consoles? You got toys. was my Come life on now. for a month i needed <laughs> one literally the first beyblade i ever had was an old one that my friend gave me w mm. friend i know w but friend. he didn't give me a launcher those Ooh. things that spun the beyblade that's a pretty so important I couldn't even use my Beyblade properly. And whenever I tried to compete with the other back. kids, I had to spin it with my hands. Ooh. Shit was sad. That it's like sad. watching someone try to fit in in a conversation they wasn't invited <laughs> to. Like, what am I doing here? I don't belong. And of course, I lost every time. My fingers could only do so much. I'm sorry, dear. I did eventually get my own Beyblade, though, with a launcher and everything. But by the time I did, dear, dear I still God. banned Beyblades. Why? They freaking banned it. Because during recess, that's all the boys would do. Get a hula hoop, use it at a stadium, <laughs> and play Beyblades in it all recess long. Why they and it? I guess these teachers didn't like us having oh, fun haters. and wanted Hate us out. to move around haters. and do an exercising activity during recess. Exercise? Which, I wanna that's what gym is for. Recess True. is our free time. From the Facts. long and excruciating work day of learning our ABCs. ABCs. Stressful. In recess, we should be free to do whatever we uh, want uh, for the next 20 minutes. Get it, yeah. But you basically though? banned us from having fun. I didn't know this school was a dictatorship. <laughs> what are you guys gonna ban next? Minorities? Because I know you guys hate a diversely fun environment. You big it. Another toy you I was very, it. very much interested in. A toy I saw all the time on TV commercials. <laughs> it was. Mushigi! What? What is that? Seeing this every commercial break after watching cartoons had me going because this looked so cool, bro. Oh, wait. Seeing I these seen people yeah. playing with Never a magic it, floating ball swerving it. around from arm to arm as if it was weightless. Yeah, I've seen the commercials. Yeah, I've seen the commercials. Like, look at that. Right now. How he do that? I wanted one expeditiously, but I never saw one at the store, so I just gave up. Shaky That's why down. I never got one. I'm not ordering off the TV. I'm afraid to talk to strangers on the phone. But after <laughs> years of constant curiosity on how my life would be so different if I had gotten one, would I have told her how I really felt back then? Would I have won the lottery? Would you have? Would I have stopped farting when I'm talking to girls? I mean, that's... Only one way to find out. So I finally you. got a Fushigi hey. ball. After years of wonder, I finally have it. Oh, come on. I finally have the Fushigi Let me know. Ball. Let me know. Now my life is finally gonna have a purpose. This <laughs> thing is gonna change everything about my life. I, I just can't wait. I can't. I gotta open, open it. it. I gotta open, open it as soon as possible. Open that. Oh, get, get it. Get, get, get it. Come on, little D. Get it. There we go. Make that, make that float. Fushigi! Finally have Fushigi! a real magic ball. My life is gonna change forever. I can't Did wait to try it. Fushigi. These are Mario outfits. All right, maybe, maybe, maybe it wasn't working right that maybe time. Maybe got like you know, a right angle. Second time, right angle. You know what right angle. Fushigi. Fly. Fly. The hell? How they work this thing in the commercial? Like you know they. Def what the? How did we sliding these things down? How, how did you? They be like, Wait, hold on now, hold on now. Wait a minute. What's how the magic behind this? Their arms and like, oh, can I at least do the upside down thing? What the hell? Wait, can how I did you do like, the upside? Was it all a trick? Oh, was it all lies? Oh Come on, Mario. Come on, Mario. Alright, I'm gonna get one more time to fly. If this don't <laughs> work, 
If this don't work, I'm gay as hell. I'm gay as hell. <laughs> Bushigi, fly! Oh, oh my damn. god. Child this bitch don't work. This Childhood. don't even work. Childhood it's not a magic ruined. ball. It's just a ball. It doesn't it's really float around like that in real life when you buy it. Those dudes in the commercials just know how to play with balls in a cool way. I just got <laughs> ripped off. My childhood dream was a lie. Uh, now I'm never going to stop stinking around girls. Speaking of them, I also sometimes had a want for girl toys. Don't tell nobody this. Seeing Listen, like... Listen, see, this is, this is a just free environment, you know, just free zone. Um, my sister at the time, she had some Barbie dolls. You know, I may have, you know, maybe, possibly, slight chance, may have played with a few Barbie dolls. I might have played some of the Barbie games on the Dreamcast or whatever system. Listen, just free, just free zone, just free zone. You know, I was a kid back then, I was just playing with toys. I saw a toy, I wanted to play with it. I might have played with some Barbie dolls. I might have put them into a Barbie house. Just free zone. And we're gonna keep it rolling. <laughs> and stuff like those invisible ink password diaries and those pixel chicks toys. Those look so cool, not even lying. And I'm the most masculine person I know. I paid for Hustlers University. So when I say <laughs> look, something's cool, it's, it's really cool. Especially that Barbie digital nail printer that basically prints anything on your nails. What? I've never seen something like that before. <laughs> I've never painted my <laughs> nails before, but that Barbie toy tempted me, bro. <laughs> that, that is honestly some advanced technology for a 2009 that is, that kids toy. But the number one thing I always wanted was an easy bake of a toy Ooh, same, that told girls same, at a young age where same. they belong. There ain't no woman so that's, that's an everyday the toy. Witch from Hansel and Gretel created this. And I found it cool just to have a <laughs> okay. whole toy oven in my room that could I really be bake so that. I don't have to leave my room again. But alas, that toy was for girls. So I never got one. Tragic. So I got one now. Okay. All right, everybody. This is Bop my it. first easy. I love bop it toys too. It came with a few Twisted. food items. Bop it came with red velvet Press cake, which kind of looks high at best. It came with mini whoopie pies, which kind of looks like dog <laughs> shit. And it came with cheese pizza, which kind of looks that like dog food. Bad. And today we're bad. only going to be trying out the red velvet cake because it's the yeah. only one that looks the least like yeah, that, dog food. That sounds really know how to work a safer option. Now, so hopefully it tastes good. All right, so I have to do this shit real quick. I'll get back on you guys in a second after okay. I whisk it up. All right, whisk it up. I just whisk the bowl up, and honestly, it don't look that bad. It actually smells pretty good. All okay. I gotta do is pour it into this tray. Ta-da! This is not perfect, but I'm not no raccoon <laughs> so it's all right. <laughs> then I put this thing in the oven for like 16 minutes, and then I turn it on, okay. and then all we gotta do is wait. Oh, let's just wait. Hey, get it, get it, hey, get it. Yeah, push-ups. Uh, all right, fitness. I think it's ready now. We get this. Why Mario costume? How the fuck you open this shit? All right. Ah. Uh, oh. Uh, okay. All right. All right. There we go. Let's, shit. Let's give it a quick Why would you touch it with your hands? <laughs> It's not not bad, life. not bad. Okay, now okay. it's time to put in my second cake mix in the oven. Now all I all gotta right. do is gotta put this cake on the side over here. Kinda hard, it's I not see. coming out. Um, should I get a knife? Oh, I got a spoon. spoon. Can't be using nice. That's not. Sick. I think I burned it. No, no, that's good. It's good. All right, y'all. I successfully <laughs> pulled it out. <laughs> it's good. It's good. Kind of. This is good enough, right? It's good enough. I and think it was put in there too the long. Same pan to pour this in. I don't know if this is gonna get contaminated or not, but I think we good, bro. I think we good. All right. Any second. Any day now. Here we go. Money is Any here. Any day now. Any the day. Money now. is oh, here. Oh, oh, oh. oh. There, there we go. We go. Right there. there we go. I spread it out. It looks pretty good. Even this though in the directions it says I should, you know, wash the baking pan, but eh, who cares about that? I, nah. I think it's gonna be pretty good. That's Mixing fine. the strawberry That's fine. with the red velvet, it, it's gotta taste better, right? Yeah. yeah right. More we're flavor. Put, more put flavor. This bitch in real quick. Then we're gonna turn this bitch on real quick again. Yeah, more and 16 wait minutes. another 16. Maybe minutes. 16 minutes is too long. Oh, push up. Get it. Did it? Uh, All right, get my bad. I'm late. I was okay. taking a deuce and I left this in for like an hour or something. What? Let's hurry this up real quick, man. All right, let's get it out. <laughs> oh, come on, man. Come. Get the. That was okay. Let's go. All right, it's good now. Why don't I get an oven mitt right next to me? Don't tell me you gotta put this in the. This don't look right. <laughs> but no, it's it is not. good enough for the. It's good enough. All right. Now like a whole I just phone. gotta put this thing on top. <laughs> all right. All right. This... That looks delicious. And then you I sure? put the frosting on this cake. You know. 
Mm-mm-mm. Oh shit, nah. it's spilling. Uh, Dipping the frosting on the cake. Do not eat cake. that. Do not eat that. That does not look mm-hmm. good. <laughs> Doesn't it look delicious, guys? Not at all. Mm, makes I you want to get a bite off the screen. Look, this is like, like the Dash. Remember Dash when he made his like, uh, ghetto cooking series? This is what this looks like. This is like a ghetto <laughs> cooking series episode 8 trying to make desserts. This does not look right. <laughs> Like All right, so apparently I <laughs> fucked up. I was supposed to mix this pink frosting with the real frosting. Come right? on, that's what it looks like. Act like you cooked before. I don't want to say what it looked like, so <laughs> let, let's just put this on real quick. <laughs> there we go. That looked good. Yeah, that, that's good enough. Well, that almost is... done, guys. We're almost done. That the adding the sprinkles. Let's go. All right. The sprinkles All right, to now what? Let's add the sprinkles. The fuck? All right, now let's <laughs> add the sprinkles. Maybe I don't want an yeah. easy bake oven. Maybe it's a good thing I didn't get it as a kid. Look at that. Valentine's Day is every Ooh. day around here. Would you look at that? Uh, yeah, that's cake. that's it definitely delicious. something. It looks uh, uh, edible. Uh, Gordon that's definitely Remy one of the cakes. Who? Remy who? Um, <laughs> this shit look delicious, you know. And now it's time to cut this masterpiece. How? Ooh, you hear that? Such a smooth cut. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> All right. I think you... Oh my god, this looks so fucking it's, good. It's All so right. it's hard. Pause. I can cut with one hand. Okay, I think <laughs> I cut myself a good piece. Oh, look at that. All right, there we go. <laughs> all right, uh, uh, it's all right, guys. And there we have it. What, what is that? Sight. Ew! What a beautiful. <laughs> Ew! I have my fork. I got my knife. Got my juice. Hey, and I got nice my fancy napkin. juice. I'm ready to napkin. gobble this thing up. It looks so good. Yummy, yeah. yummy, yummy. All right, let me get a bite out of this. And we're going to finally test how oh, good God. my I'm, I'm scared for him. cooking skills are. Childhood dream coming true right now. I, I cannot wait to put this in I'm my I'm glad stomach. you made there the cake go. and not the pizza. Bottoms up. Oh, my God. Nah. No. This, nah, nah, this is good. He's, he's actually, actually YouTube. Oh. This actually tastes fantastic. Okay. The, 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 right, the, the right. of the of the of the flavor. Looks, it's it, even. It's like yeah. An actual five star course meal. I, I'm surprised. Sure. Easy yeah. bake. You surprised me. This meal was fantastic. Oh, I, I gotta have another bite. Bottoms up. Oh. Oh no. No hitting that reality cake. <laughs> now, no, 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 a little these down. He's down. Ah, ah, oh God, this is easy make up. Oh, he's dead. He's done. Ah, <laughs> uh, you hate this. 2019. Ah, uh, you hate to see. Yeah. What? Well, yeah. no, that's good. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay, well, that happened. That definitely happened. <laughs> After watching this, maybe it's good I didn't have some of those toys I always went as a kid. Like the Easy Bake Oven, for example. And uh, the Fuki, Fuki, Fukishi, Fushishi, 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 Fushishi. I'm glad I never got that. I didn't think I would have to say this, but RP to the generosity. He uh, met us in because of an Easy Bake Oven gone wrong experiment. He will be missed. He will be missed. <laughs> the main toys I had back when I was a kid were the action figures, like the WWE, some of the superhero toys. I had a bop it. I had some like remote control toys, some cars too. Hot Wheels. I had some Hot Wheel cars. Yep, yep. I remember back then, like in school, people had like those little, those little skateboards, like you ride with your two fingers that you do tricks with. I never owned one, but those are pretty cool to watch. Um, but no, toys are great. It was great being a kid back then around like the toy era, I guess you can say. I mean, there's still toys, but yeah. People got smartphones now. People, mainly kids, I feel like, are on their smartphones and like playing with toys. Back then, smartphones were like common when I was growing up. I feel like I'm old. I'm not that old, but it was, it was great. It was a great time. Great time. You know, this was hilarious to watch. I forgot all about the fushishi, the, the the lie that it is. No magic ball, you lied to us. Let me know down below what was your favorite toy to have as a kid, or even now in general, because I think. My favorite toy was probably the action figures because I was like I was playing with toys a lot. The uh, wrestling one, I, I was playing them with them heavily. That and the uh, that little weird toy thing that are in the doctor's office. I don't know what it's called. Please let me know what the name is down below because I'm always just curious what those toys are called in the doctor's office. But yeah, that's gonna do it for this video. Hope you enjoyed my reaction. We're back here. We're back reacting to more content. This is gonna be great. Great times. Great times. <laughs> 
Oh, man. But thank you for watching. My cup of tea is out of here. Um, and this is... Man. I will never, ever buy an easy bake oven now. I don't want to <laughs> try that. I got me a grill oven. I'm just going to use that to make food because that, that looked horrible. <laughs> that looked horrible. <laughs>